Well, I always feel a bit ashamed travelling abroad being British because it's a quite useless country in many ways. We've achieved nothing of any value since the war when we helped to liberate France and that, of course, seems of questionable worth in retrospect. But... <laughs> nothing since the Russians were the first to put a living creature in space, the dog Laika in space, end of the 50s. That dog went up there, orbited the Earth twice, but no preparations were made to return it safely, and it shot down through the ozone layer, was burnt up, and died. Which is sad, but also lucky in a way. Because if aliens had intercepted that Russian dog, they would have assumed that the planet Earth was ruled by a race of creatures who like to lick their own genitals, <laughs> rub themselves against your leg as a form of friendly greeting, <laughs> sniff each other's asses, <laughs> and yet had somehow managed to develop the technology for space travel. <laughs> and the Americans were the first to put a man on the moon in 1969. American crew went up there, they all returned safely the mission was a success with no loss of human life which is sad but <laughs> we're lucky in a way because if aliens had intercepted Americans They would have assumed that the planet Earth was ruled by a race of massively obese creatures in Hawaiian shirts <laughs> who had no idea of the geography of their own planet and yet had somehow managed to develop the technology for space travel. And John Denver, of course, died last year. What a lot of people don't know about John Denver, he was a massive massive fan of flight generally and of space flight as well. At the time of his death, John Denver was actually negotiating with the Russian Space Authority for what they would charge him to actually send him into space and put him on the Mir space station. That is true. But John Denver, of course, tragically died before he was able to fulfill that dream. Which is sad. But also lucky in a way. <laughs> because if aliens had intercepted John Denver, they would have seen that the planet Earth was ruled by a race of well meaning but ultimately bland entertainers <laughs> who deserve to die. And.